New at 11 tonight, right now a battle over taxes in a financially troubled city is underway and taxpayers are caught in the middle. The mayor trying to raise more money to keep the city afloat while the city council wants to cut taxes to keep residents happy. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Campbell is live in Winsocket breaking things down for us and what it all means for taxpayers. The city council president says the tax bills that are going out right now are flat out wrong and he says he wants them to be fixed. Tax bills have been sent out in Woonsocket and they're higher than some city councilors expected. They do not reflect, I repeat, they do not reflect the wishes of this body. So the city council president called an emergency meeting Wednesday evening. We needed this emergency meeting to stop that, to protect the taxpayers from the Lisa Baldelli Hunt tax increase. In a letter to the city council, the mayor said she set the tax rate within the range allowed by the ordinances passed by the council. The mayor's office says the mayor was forced to raise taxes after the state expressed concerns with the budget. The mayor set a levy in full compliance with the council, original council resolution. It is spelled out. But some city councilors yes, say the mayor is misinterpreting the law. Our taxpayers caught in the middle between the mayor's office and city council? I hope not, and that's what this meeting was supposed to stop. That is not our intention, and unfortunately, that's what happens. What is fair is fair, and we can't continue to burden our taxpayers with excessive taxes. Even with the mayor's levy, we're talking about $5.50 a month on a house in Woonsocket that's valued at $150,000. If you do the math, that comes out to an extra $66 for the year. The city council passed the emergency ordinance by a vote of 5 to 1. Now the mayor has 10 days to either sign it or veto it. Live in Woonsocket with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Susan Campbell, Eyewitness News.